You keep tumbling at this, mate. It hasn't been a meet of truly gluttonous world records, though, because often what that means is there's races where swimmers have just gone out and owned it, and it's quite actually quite a boring race in that sense for the neutral. We have seen so much competitive swimming, and we've seen so much of what we saw in that men's S14 where we had two world record pace setters. It's, it's been ridiculous. This race was a fantastic one as well. Louise Fitters of Great Britain got plenty of support in the stands. You can see her mates opposite us going absolutely crazy. They're making Louise laugh on the podium. Not sure what the 2-2s are all about. I think Louise probably knows. Bethany Firth enjoys another medal in this pool. It all started for her as a Paralympic athlete in 2012, winning that 100 meter backstroke gold. But neither of them could get close to Valeria Shabalina of Russia. This was such an impressive swim. She's been pretty level headed all the way through this meet, Shabalina. And the way she celebrated that medal on the lane rope and the way she's smiling on the podium, I think this is the one she really, really wanted. Yeah, this is the one that has definitely got the most emotion out of Jabalina. And she swam phenomenally well. Ladies and gentlemen, the national anthem of Russian Federation. She has had a brilliant meet, Valeria Shabalina. Make no mistake about that. It's her fifth medal of the competition. She took silver in the backstroke behind Bethany Firth and bronze in the breaststroke behind 